Have you ever wanted to produce a high quality image from one of your movies? Uh, we're going to show you how using iMovie. We've opened up a new project which is clear and we're going to select the clip that we want to take the still from. So with uh, this in mind we can uh, select this clip and we can scrub through uh, as we want. And we're going to come and reach the image that we want which is just there. And I'm going to right click and go down to where it says add still frame to project. This will add a series of frames which uh, will be your uh, in your default. Well, we're going to select all of these by clicking and dragging out this. Now we're going to right click and delete selection. That leaves us with one uh, frame. Um, and at the moment we got that on Ken Burns. So we're going to go up and uh, fit that um, so that we've got a single frame. We're going to go up now to click share and we're going to go down to export using QuickTime. This will bring up a, uh, a little box we're going to put uh, in there Dolly Skater and we're going to save it to the desktop and down here we've got uh, movie to sequence. If we click that you can export in uh, all these different ways. We're going from uh, movie to image sequence and in the options see we've got JPEG selected. If we go into the options um, you've got all these you can choose these different qualities. We're going for the best uh, there is. Um, we're going to say OK to that and we're going to say save that. Uh, so run through and save. Uh, it's exported in that. And then we're going to go down to uh, Finder. And we're on our desktop. We're choosing our desktop. And there you are, Dolly Skater. We'll double click that. And there you are. You can see that uh, in preview. And there's your still, um, which is a, a higher quality JPEG or a TIFF or a PNG. Just uh, you choose what you want it to be. I'm Mick Sadler. Thanks for watching.